city like Nashville, where the cost of living keeps increasing, it can be difficult for people to find stable housing. There are hundreds of homeless people still living on the streets. Now the city and nonprofit groups are working on solutions. News Channel 5's Kyle Horan introduces us to a pair that just got into their new home right before the holidays. For the two women, Margaret and Patricia, it really set in last night when temperatures dipped down into the freezing levels. They got to stay inside in their warm beds and they said it's something they've come to appreciate. It's still a little weird after staying six years on the streets. For a while we lived in the car I had before the motor finally locked up and I had to sell it for junk. Patricia Davis and Margaret McKinney were homeless just three weeks ago. They would have been staying under a tarp and tent through the holidays had they not been approved for this housing. It squeezes on the tarps because we had tarps over the tent. And when we had that ice storm, we stayed out in it, but it was hard. Davis and McKinney give the credit to people loving Nashville and a local church group for this. Two beds, a bathroom, nearby kitchen, and a place to shower and do laundry. Simple things so many people take for granted, but that hundreds live without every day in the city. Monday before the 13th, we got told. And it's like, okay, is this for real? because we wasn't given an address or anything. And then all of a sudden we get told on a Monday and we move in the following month. They've been here about a week and a half and haven't finished organizing everything yet. This year, more than 190 people died out in the elements. Friends of the pair are still on the street. So while they're grateful they can spend this Christmas with a real tree, they're hoping the city finds a way to get many others into permanent homes. It's not easy living out there, but you adapt and adjust. Kyle Horan, News Channel 5.